All right, I'm People Shays here, and I'm here to do an unboxing for you guys today of the Transformers, the original or the complete original series DVD set. This is the original G1 Transformers from the '80s. Um, the entire series. I have uh, I already did an unboxing years ago for the Shout Factory release of the Transformers the movie, which is the movie I believe that takes place in between. I think it was season two and three of this show. Um, Maybe it was one and two. Either way, I think it was two and three, but I could be wrong. Um, yeah, and they recently, in the last few years, re-released that movie on 4K, as well as did a Steelbook release. So, yeah. Um, but I thought to get this because, well, they've been doing... Shout Factory's been doing the Transformers DVD releases for so long. I might as well. And also Blu-ray for some of the shows that were made in HD. Yeah, and as you guys already know, I did uh, unbox it, or I got and unboxed the shows in the Unicron trilogy. So yeah, there's also the fact that they did release the Japanese version of the series um, on DVD as well, but I think that's gone out of print because I'm assuming the license expired, but I could be wrong. But yeah, uh, but what I know is that it's not available anymore. So at least not where I look. So yeah. But, anyways, um, yeah. So here we go with the front. You got this uh, little cardboard box around it, which is... It's fine. Um, you got Optimus Prime right there. The Transformers logo, complete original series. More than meets the eye. Spine right here, complete original series, 15 DVDs. Uh, I think that's Starscream in his jet form. Logo again. This is Transformers Collector's Edition, Shout Factory, and everything. Bottom has nothing. Top just has the Transformers logo and Megatron again. Or, no, not again, just Megatron. And then we have the back. All 98 episodes from all four seasons. We got Megatron again. Description of the series. Bonus features include retrospective featurettes from the files of Teletron 2, PSAs, toy commercials, and an art gallery. Total runtime approximately 37 hours. Not rated for all audiences. Show Factory licensed by Hasbro, DVD, NTSC. So, yeah. Design post positive. Okay. So, here we go with the complete first season set. Where you have the Transformers logo, then Optimus Prime and Megatron. Spine right here, Transformers, logo and everything. And then the back. Got some screenshots from some of the episodes. Description of the season. Um, or maybe the set itself. Yeah. Or no, just the season. Bonus features restored to the original broadcast versions with a new stereo soundtrack created from the original audio. Triple char or changer from toy to comic to screen. The origins of the Transformers. A printable script, rare PSA, archival Hasbro toy commercials. Interesting. Total runtime about six hours. So yeah. I don't know if these were released individually. I imagine they might have been. I don't know. So then right here you got the disc and episode lists on the front and uh, back of the inside cover. As well as some of the artwork and everything. Of some of the Transformers. You got disc one. Disc 2, and then a bonus features disc. So, yeah. I was trying to think of this. If this was released individually, then it's a lot like Danny Phantom, where that got, like, four different sets, where you have season 1, and season 2 was split into two volumes for some reason. Even though it had the same amount of episodes, I believe, or roughly the same amount of episodes as season 1. And then season 3 was released in its own set, but then they did a complete series set, I think, before season, the, th the Season 3 set came out, so... Or at roughly the same time, so... Yeah. Here we go with the Season 2 Volume 1. Transformers logo. Optimus Prime and Megatron again, and... Uh, I know Grimlock. Another one of the Dinobots, and this guy. No idea who he is. I have not really seen a lot of G1 Transformers. Most I've seen is like clips, and then I've seen the movie. 
here we go with the spine and then the back. This is first 28 episodes, so interesting. Same setup as the first one. Well, it says 11 hours because there's more episodes than this. We got, I think, Bumblebee right there. It's in disc one, two, three, and four. And then the disc and episode lists are right there. So, yeah. Then we got season two, uh, volume two. With all this stuff on the front, all these characters. I don't know why I guess that this seems to be the only stock art they have of uh, Optimus Prime and Megatron. But whatever. Oh, maybe they're zooming. Yeah, it seems like they're zooming out for the first two seasons at the very least, for the first three volumes of them. But it's just like, why? You got the spine, and then the back with everything. And this fe bonus features list, the combiner forming the Transformers animated series featurette, rare PSAs, archival Hasbro toy commercials, and concept art. Approximately eight hours. So, yeah. So you got the disc and episode lists on the front instead of the back. I don't know why they did it on the back for the first volume. Then you got the discs. And the bonus features disc. And you got that stock art of Megatron. And then we got seasons three and four. Because I guess there were less episodes than these. Um, so you got everything. You got these guys on the front. Isn't that Rodimus Prime? Or Hot Rod or whatever. And then that's Unicron's head. So yeah, I think, I believe the movie takes place in between seasons two and three. Because they're including references to stuff that was introduced in the movie, I believe. Or at the very least shown for the first time in the movie. So, yeah. Which I think that then incorporated into the show, obviously. But yeah. Spine. And then the back. Bonus features the Autobots, the Decepticons, and the fans. A look at the local, or loyal, fans of the Transformers. From the files of Teletran 2. Or Teletron 2? I'm not sure. Rare PSAs, archival Hasbro toy commercials, and art gallery. Approximately nine hours. So then here we go. Disc 1, 2, 3, and 4. Disc and episode lists right there, and the bonus features list, which I guess is on the last disc. So, yeah. <clears throat> so, that's basically it. Finally have G1 Transformers, so it'll be interesting to watch and take a look at for future videos. But yeah, so I really don't have much else to say. So, links, description, all my shit, subscribe if you want, and I'll see you guys in the next one.